Homicide 1919, the case of 34-year-old Ling Sing Lok. Ling Lok was convicted of the manslaughter of Ah Pao. He hit him over the head with a chopper in West India Dock Road, London, on the 9th of October 1919. Ah Pao had been an assistant cook and had lived in Upper North Street in Poplar. A ship steward had lived in Limehouse said that he had known Ah Pao for about three years. He said that he had been standing in West India Dock Road outside a barber's shop at 53 West India Dock Road near Pennyfields with a friend when he saw our pal, who he spoke to. He said that Ling Lok then came out of the English and Chinese restaurant at 39-41 to 41 West India Dock Road and joined them. He said that he then said to our pal, Why don't you get some sleep? To which he said our pal replied, It is too early to go to bed. He said that Apau didn't speak to Ling Lok, and nor did Ling Lok speak to Apau, but then he then saw Ling Lok take a chopper out from underneath his coat, and grasping it with two hands, strike Apau with it on the side of the head, felling him to the ground. He said that whilst Apau was on the ground, that Ling Lok then struck him again with the chopper, after which he ran off through Limehouse Causeway, taking the chopper with him. Another seaman that had been nearby said that he had also seen Ling Lok strike Apau, and said that he thought he was going to strike him too, and so he ran away. When Ling Lok ran away, he was chased, and along the way, he threw the chopper into a urinal underneath the railway bridge. A police constable that had been on duty in West India Dock Road said that he saw a large crowd gathered, and when he went to sea, he saw Apau lying on the roadway with his head near the curb. He said that he then went for an ambulance and took Apau to Lime Street Police Station, where he was seen by a police surgeon who immediately ordered his removal to Poplar Hospital. A police sergeant later gave evidence stating that he recognised Apau as the man that had come into Limehouse Police Station in 1916 to be registered as an alien. He said that he later saw him on the Thursday evening, 9th of October 1919, at the police station suffering from severe wounds to his head and later heard of his death. The house surgeon at Poplar Hospital said that our pal was dead when he was admitted to the hospital. He said that he had three wounds on his head and one on his shoulder and they were all of a severe character and must have been caused by a sharp instrument, adding that in his opinion the chopper later shown to him was the weapon used. When Ninglock was arrested he said, When I stopped at Slater Street he came and asked me five pounds. I gave him five pounds. Tonight he see me, he asked me ten pounds. I say, no money. He got chopper. I caught his hand and took chopper from him. I hit him on head. He fall down. I hit him again. I ran away through causeway and threw chopper near bridge. Two other Chinamen were with their pal. When he appeared in court, he said, Me wanted to say chopper belonged to other man, not me. Ning Lok was tried for murder at the Old Bailey on Thursday the 20th of November 1919, but his plea of guilty to manslaughter was accepted and he was sentenced to three years penal servitude.